Okay, hello guys. Hello, good night. Good night, teacher. So, how are you, Dina? How are you tonight? I'm fine. Okay, perfect. Hello, Anna. How are you? Fine, thanks. Mm -hmm. What about you? I'm really excellent. Thank you. Okay, girls. Well, you know, let's wait a couple of minutes for your classmates to join to the class, right? Because it's uh, uh, 8 p.m. already. So let's see. Well, some of you guys, um, they are not going, going to get connected. Some of you um, text me on my WhatsApp telling me that they don't have internet connection, right? Um, and they don't have light. So guys, um, if you get disconnected during, you know, the meeting, do not worry, okay? Because some of you, they're not going to be here due to, you know, because probably there is a storm, so they don't have electricity, right? So it's okay. So, but well, for the ones that are here, welcome, welcome. We are in, guys, in unit number four already. So yesterday, guys, we were discussing about adjectives. Right, how to describe people and everything, right? So now, guys, let's see. I have, you know, something for you guys. So I have, guys, this little quiz that we are going to make it, okay? First, let's see what is, you know, this quiz about, okay? So it's about adjective appearance, okay? So let's see, guys. Let's, you know, play it. And then you're going to do it by your own, okay? Let's make something. So guys, what is this? Is long hair or short hair? Tell me. Long hair. Long, long hair. hair. Long hair. Very nice, guys. Now let's see. What is this, guys? Fair, fair hair or dark hair? What do you think? Mm. Mm -hmm. Fair hair or dark hair? A or B, guys? What do you think? Yes? I think it is A. Fair hair, okay. Dark hair. Okay. Well, fair, guys, is like blonde, okay? Blonde. Um, and blonde means rubio, right? So, este es pelo rubio y este es pelo okay. oscuro, right? Okay. So, this is dark hair. dark hair. Dark hair. Excellent. Now let's see this one, guys. This is dark hair or red hair? Yes, guys. Red hair. Red hair because it's red, yeah. right? Very nice. Okay, guys. Now we are going, you know, to make this exercise by your arm, okay? I'm going to share you the link here on the chat of Zoom so you can copy and paste, okay? And after well, you finish this exercise, you can send it to the WhatsApp group, okay? So let me also share you to the WhatsApp, you know, chat. So if you can get it, right? So guys, let's start doing this exercise. It's very easy, guys, okay? It's about descriptions. We made, you know, this one yesterday. And if you have any question, just let me know, okay? So come on, guys. Let's finish the exercise, please. Okay. The link is in the chat here on Zoom and let me send you to the chat of God's all right, so you can get it. Let's see, it's just loading. By the way, guys, is it raining in your houses or not? Is it raining there? No, because I'm not. No, feeling... teacher. No. Okay. Yes, much. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I can see. It. Yeah, because some of you guys much. Are really, wow. Well, some some of you guys are are not going to be here tonight because they don't have electricity, right? Even though some teachers, they don't have electricity tonight, but well, now, you know, don't worry, I'm not going to lose the, the electricity, 
But if some of you got disconnected, guys, due to, you know, uh, lose the internet or the electricity, it's okay, right? Because, I mean, there are there is a storm, so, of course. Now, guys, let's see. Well, I have already sent you as well the link. Okay, I have here the first one. Very nice. 13 of 14. Very nice, guys. So, we have here, right? Uh, we... Well, difference one. We have, you know, the type of hair, if they are using glasses or not. What else? Eyes, the color of the eyes, right? So remember that yesterday we were, you know, discussing about this, right? The class was about that. So come on, guys. Let's, you know, finish it and let's see. Okay, just one participant and finish the exercise. What about the rest, guys? Come on. If you have any question about something that you don't understand, let me know, okay? So let's see. Okay, we have this one, guys. So come on. If you have, guys, well, if you don't understand anything, just let me know, right? So let's see. Um, Guys, for tonight, uh, we are going, you know, to finish one of the exercises that we have in the platform, right? Because we are going to see, you know, how to resolve this one, right? So you will see that it's very easy, guys. But now, let's see. Okay, some of you have sent me the picture. That's very nice, guys. Perfect. Okay, guys. So, you know, let's continue. I have here, you know, this one. This little exercise that is for all, okay? For all the people in general. So let's see, who's Anna, okay, who's Anna? We have here, well, no Anna, no Anna here, right? So this one. So we have this one, the one with curly hair, the one with the straight hair, or the one with wavy hair? So guys. The one with straight hair. Okay, with the straight hair. And what is the straight hair, guys? Um, Lisa. Exactly. A straight hair is pelo liso. Curly hair, pelo colocho. Wavy hair, pelo ondulado, right? So this one, very nice. Now let's see. Who is Lucy? She has got dark wavy hair. Okay, or she has, right? Remember, she has got, or she's got, or she has, right? Like this one, dark wavy hair. Okay. What do you think is the correct one, guys? A, B, or C? C. Letter C. Letter C. Okay. Dark. Okay. Wavy. Yes. Hair. So perfect. Very nice. Now let's see. We have you. Well, can you see Mark? He has got dark curly hair. Dark curly hair. What do you think, guys? A, B, or C? A. 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 Very nice. Yeah. Now, this one. What does Holly look like? She has got blonde hair and green eyes. She has got blonde hair and blue eyes. Or she got blonde hair and brown eyes. So, guys, A, B, or C? Look at the picture, guys. Blonde hair, of course, she has blonde mm -hmm. hair. Okay. There are three. Blue eyes, exactly. Now this one. What does Patrick look like? He has got dark hair, a mustache, and a beard. He has got long hair, a mustache, and a beard. He's got green eyes, a mustache, and a beard. What do you think, guys? Hey. 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 Very nice. Hey. Now this one, it says, uh, let me see, sorry, I can, my boyfriend's over there. He's got a straight dark hair and a mustache. What do you think, guys? A, B, or C? A. 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 Okay, very nice. Hey. A straight dark hair and a mustache, right? We got it. perfect. Now this one, guys. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so 
can you see my mom okay her hair is blonde and she always wears some glasses she's got reddish hair and she always wears sunglasses or she's got dark wavy hair and she always wears sunglasses what do you think guys a b or b. c Letter B. B. Why is letter B, guys? What is reddish? Reddish? Rojizo. Rojizo. Exactly. Very nice. Rojizo. Now, can you describe your teacher, Sandra? Her hair is wavy and her eyes are blue. She has got green eyes and curly fair hair. Her eyes are brown and she's got the straight fair hair. What do you think, guys? Mm -hmm. C. C. Let it see. Let it see. Very nice. Okay. So we got it, guys. We got a 10. So, well, that's excellent. So it means that we know it. We know how to describe. So that's very nice. Now, guys, you know, let's move on. I have here another quiz for you. Okay. So let's see this one. Okay. So we have this one. Okay, let's look at she. Well, sorry, this one. Let's, you know, may open the boxes. So we are going to open instead the boxes. So I'm going to choose some of you, okay, guys? So this exercise, we are going to, do, you know, to make it. So let's see, I'm going to choose uh, randomly some of you. Or do I have a volunteer? Someone who wants to participate? Volunteer or big team? Yes. Okay. Okay, Eduardo. Okay, perfect, Eduardo. So, Eduardo, give me a box. Tell me what number do you prefer? From one to <laughs> Box five. Okay, box five. Remember, well, the game is simple, Eduardo. You are going to see a picture, and the picture is going to tell you a description, okay? And you have to tell me if it is true or false, okay? So remember that we have time, so be ready. Now this one. Abraham Simpson has got big eyes. He's old and fat. True or false? True. Let's see. Perfect, yeah. He has big eyes, right? And he is old, of course, and fat. Now. Thank you, Eduardo. So do I have another volunteer? A volunteer for tonight? Okay, Sandra. Okay, and, and then Jenny. Okay, let's start with Sandra. So Sandra, give me a box, please. Choose one box. Box four. Four, let's see. Okay, Linda is short. She has got brown hair. Is it true or false? Brown hair. Yeah. <laughs> False. Okay. Perfect. Very nice. Because this is not brown, right? It's like reddish. reddish. Exactly. Reddish. Yeah. Now let's see. Jenny. Jenny, choose a box, please. Number one. Okay. Number one. Okay. It's a verb is tall and fat. He has got blue hair. True or false? False. <laughs> yeah, yeah, of course it's false because it's, I mean, it's tall, but it's not fat, right? And he doesn't have blue hair. Very nice. Now let's see another volunteer for tonight. Who wants to participate? Yes. Okay, let's see. We well, have Delmi and Salvador. So Delmi, let's start with you. So Delmi, choose a box, please. Um, two. Number two, let's see. Okay. Luna Loud is short and thin. She has got brown hair. Is it true or false? It's true. Perfect, very nice. Thank you. Tell me now. Let's see, Salvador. Salvador, choose a box three or six. Three. Okay. So you say, Marsh 
is short and old. She has got blonde hair. Is it true or false? False. Yeah, false, because she doesn't have blonde hair, right? And now we have the last one. So, Dina, Dina, choose a box, please. <laughs> so, okay, six. Yeah, because <laughs> now let's see this one. Lincoln Loud is young and thin. He has got white hair. Is it true or false? True. True. Perfect. Okay, guys. So we got it. So it means we got a 10. So perfect, guys. So, well, guys, do we have any question? Do you know about adjectives? Is there anything that you don't know so far? Yes, no? Yes, no? Not yet. Okay. Teacher. Yeah? Sí, solamente eh, para que me aclare una duda, eh, eh, ¿en qué momento utilizamos, no sé si es verbo, got? She has got, ah, oh, well, she has got, you can use it um, anytime that you are going to describe body, skin, eyes, hair, okay? You can use has got or just has, okay? It's, it's the same, okay? Yesterday we were mentioned that, that you can use has got or has. It's, both are the same, okay? It doesn't matter if you use it or not, right? Puedes usar solo has o puedes usar has got. Eso depende de ti, right? Porque es lo mismo, right? Um, Perfect, teacher. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, guys. Now, um, does anybody have any other question, guys? Yes, no? Okay. So it means that we are going to continue. So, guys, let's see. I have, you know, this picture. Well, if you have seen the videos on the platform, you will see this part, right? So let me make it bigger for you so you can see it very clear. Well, um, sorry for the quality of the pictures. I could, I just could get like this, right? But I, I know that you can see it because I can see it, guys. Now let's see. Guys, for describing people, we use some questions, right? So... We have for general appearance, for age, for height, and hair, right? So let's see. For general appearance, guys, we use this common question. What does she look like? Or what does he look like? Um, what does Pedro look like? What does your brother look like? Yeah? So we use this one, look like, right? What does you look like? When we are talking about, you know, general appearance. So for example... She is tall with red hair. She is gorgeous, right? Does he wear glasses? Okay, you know what are glasses, right? And you know this very well, right? For example, I wear a teacher, I wear shoes, I wear jeans, I wear a cap, right? Like this one. So guys, we have this question for general appearance and this one, right? This is a yes or no question, okay? You can ask her, yes, and she has a pair, right? Just an example. For example, we can say, do you wear glasses? Okay. Viste anteojos? Yes, I wear glasses. You can say like that. Right? Now, guys, for age, for age, you know this question, right? How old is she? How old are you? How old is your brother, right? Like this one. So in order to ask for age, we use how old, right? How old is or how old are, okay? And you can say, she's about 32. She's um, 22 years old, right? She's in her 30s, right? How old is he? Okay, you see how old is he? How old is your brother? How old is your sister? And we have for high guys, for high. We use this question, how tall is she? Okay, how tall? This is the question, how tall is he? How tall is your brother? How tall are you? Do, you, do we get it, guys? Do we get it how to ask this question? Yes? No? Yes. ¿Estamos yes. entendiendo hasta aquí, chicos? Yes. 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 Okay, perfect, yes. very nice. So, guys, for how this one, so you see how tall is he, how tall is she? And we can answer, guys. She is one meter 88. 
She is six feet two. He's quite short, or he is very tall, or he is pretty tall. You remember? And for hair, guys, we can ask this question. How long is her hair? Well, we don't usually ask for, I mean, the long of the hair, right? No solemos preguntar si el pelo de alguien es largo o no, right? But, by, but this is good to know, right? How long is her hair? How long is your hair? How long is your sister hair? For example, is medium length, is short, is long, right? But this one, yeah, we used to ask this one. What color is her hair? What color is your hair? What color is your mother hair? Is dark, is red, reddish, is blonde, is brown, okay? Like this one. So guys, let's see. Uh, well, it says that, you know, for physically we use this one, right? What, you know? Do you look like, what does your mother look like for age? How old is or are, right? How old is your sister or how old are you? For high, how tall is your sister or how tall are you, okay? How tall? So guys, let's see. Do we have any questions so far? Yes, no? 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 So I'll uh, let's see in the chat box. Teacher está compartiendo pantalla. Ah, uh, yeah. Can you see my screen, guys? Pueden ver mi pantalla, chicos. Yes, yes. teacher. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. okay, very nice. Sorry, teacher. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Uh, I I I have how problem with connection. Oh, okay. Okay, Alvaro. It's, yes. it's okay, don't worry. So okay, guys. So I know you say sorry, not... teacher. Sorry, don't worry, Alberto. It's okay. So, guys, I know that some of you say algunos de ustedes probablemente se han de haber quedado en la luz, and it's okay. Y tal vez tengan pena de preguntar. It's okay, guys. So, se lo puede hacer un poco más claro, right? So, guys, le voy a dar como la fórmula que pueden utilizar si quieren hacer una pregunta, right? So, guys, primero tenemos general appearance, right? We say it. general appearance, right? General. Appearance, okay. Appearance. So, guys, para esto vamos a utilizar W equation, que es más que todo what, right? What? What plus do or does, right? Okay. Plus the subject, okay? Your mother. Um, and then we have look like, okay? And at the end, question mark. So let me make it bigger, guys, so you can see it very clear. Let's see. Okay, like this, right? So, guys, let's see. Esta es la formula, right, guys? So, for example, what, for example, si yo quiero preguntarle cómo se mira a su hermano, cómo luce su hermana. What does, por qué does? Porque la regla de la tercera persona, right? What does your brother, right? Brother, ya sabemos que es he, ¿verdad? So, por eso ocupamos does. Brother, look like. Okay? ¿Cómo luce tu hermano? Okay? Y aquí tenemos las possible answers. Right? Podemos decir, ah, he's tall, he's handsome, he's ugly. Sí, es ugly, right? He's short, right? Now, guys, tenemos... Es a general appearance, guys. Tenemos age. Age es lo más fácil de lo más fácil, right, guys? Porque esto ya es algo que venimos viendo. Solo vamos a preguntar how old, ok, how old, más verbo to be, ok, más sujeto, ok. So, for example, guys, how old are you, ok, you see, like this one, para preguntar de la edad, right, like this, ok, general appearance, ok, general appearance, guys. Uh, let me see if I can. General appearance, age, y tenemos tall, well, height. Height, guys. Height, you know, is very easy. So, vamos a preguntar. Well, let me delete this one. Sorry, guys. I don't have more space. So, okay, tenemos high, right, guys? High. Tenemos how tall, okay? 
Siempre vamos a ocupar esto, okay, guys. How tall, para saber cuánto mide una persona, right, de alto. How tall, más verbo to be, okay, verb to be, plus subject, okay. Y sabemos que como es una pregunta, siempre va a ir el question. Mark. So, una pregunta todo. How tall, verbo to be, depende del sujeto. Hagamos are, y sujeto, you. Like this, how tall are you? ¿Qué tan alto eres, right? Y aquí tenemos las possible answers. She's one meter, she's six feet, right? Like this one. And now let's see. And for the last one, guys, let me erase. Ya copiamos esto, right, guys? Si por lo que no entendimos, si ya lo copiamos. So, y la última, chicos. Let's see, tenemos hair. Para preguntar del hair, right? Hair, guys. Well, hair. Creo que es algo bastante fácil y, y también no es algo que tan, tan se utilice tanto, right, guys? So, for example, tenemos what, okay? What color? Si vamos a preguntar el color, right? What color plus verb to be, okay? Your sujeto y al final hair, right? And this one. So let's see, guys. So tenemos, por ejemplo, what color is his hair? Okay, what color is your hair? What color is your brother's hair? Okay, like this one. So guys, do we have any question acerca de las preguntas hasta aquí? ¿Cómo formarlas? Yes, no? Poquito? No. Okay, guys. So I like it. So now, guys, let's see. I think we are ready. Um, let's see. Let's move on, guys, to the platform. Okay, vamos a ver. So, guys, tenemos estos ejercicios, okay? So, tenemos el primero. La respuesta dice, my brother is 26 years old. ¿Cuál es la pregunta para preguntarle la edad, chicos? How old is your brother? How old, exactly. En este caso, your brother, right? Yeah. Like this one. Ahora tenemos esta. Um, 100. I'm sorry, guys, there is a background noise. Um, 173 centimeters, right? One meter, 73 centimeters. Ah, uh, el primero. ¿Qué falta aquí? Ah, how old? Sorry, yeah. How old is. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, how old is your brother? Thank you. Yes, uh, how tall? How tall are you? Are you, exactly. Now let's see. He's tall and... Para preguntar sobre la apariencia, guys. ¿Cuál era? What does... What does... What does, in este caso, he look he like? Look he like, looks. exactly. Porque estamos look aquí, like. la respuesta es con he, right? Entonces es he. Now, vamos a ver esta. Bueno, esta es para medir el cabello, right? ¿Cómo preguntamos para medir? How long, right? How long, How long is, is your sister hair, right? Ahora. Volvemos a preguntar la edad, chicos. Aquí, ¿cuál sería? How old are you? Exactly. Y this one, guys. They are nice, beautiful, very tall. Para preguntar de la appearance, guys. What do they look like? Exactly, porque aquí la respuesta es they, right? Aquí vamos a ocupar do porque es they, right? Dos lo vamos a ocupar cuando es he, she, or it, right? Y ahora, este es lo mismo, right? Para preguntar cuál es el tamaño. How tall, right? Is he, exactly. So let's see, guys. Aquí lo tenemos, right? How tall is he? What do they look like? Okay. How old are you? 
How long is your sister hair? Bueno, en este caso, de esta manera lo pide, right, guys? Sister's hair. What does he look like? How tall are you? And this one. So, excellent, guys. So, we got it. So, let, sorry, guys. I'm going to mute all of you because there are, like, background noise, right? So, guys, we got this, right? So the first exercise of this unit is already done, right, guys? So now I have something for you guys, because yesterday we were discussing about adjectives. Now we are going to see deeper, see adjectives deeper, right? So guys, yesterday we were, you know, like introducing the topic, right? Now we are going to see more about this one because this is, you know, when we are talking about adjectives, it's kind of long, right? So we have this one, right? For physical description, we have this question, you see? What does he or she look like? We have height, tall, short, medium height. We have the build, okay, build. Slim, thin, plump, fat, okay, skinny. Age, young, elderly, middle age, teenager, in his 20s, 30s, 40s. Face, guys. We have round, oval, square, with the scars, wrinkles, freckles, eyes, big eyes, round blue eyes, large, small, e hair. We have bold, straight, curly, speaking, okay, like this one. So probably, guys, you can see here some adjectives that you don't know, right? But do not worry. We are going to see them, okay? So let's see, we have this one, high, you see medium height, sorry, high is height, medium height, short and tall. Build, what is build? It's like the body, right? The kind of body. We have a skinny, you see skinny, a slim or thin, okay? Feet, you see? We have this one, muscular or well built, okay? For men. Plump, okay, plump. We have fat or obese, okay. Now, this one, age. She's a teenager. She is young. What is teenager, guys? In Spanish, teenager? Adolescente. Exactly, adolescente, perfect. Now, let's see. Well, we have middle age, elderly, okay. Face, we have this different kind of face, right? Oval, round, hair, square, triangle, diamond, okay? Different kind of face, right? And we have here some example, guys. Remember that yesterday we were discussing when to use has, has got and when to use the bird to be, right? So she has got a round face. She has got an oval face, okay? So Selena Gomez, you see, round face. And here... It's an oval face, you see? Now, eyes, guys. Well, eyes, you know that they can be big or small and with different colors, right? Blue, violet, gray, green, okay? I know the all people here, we have blue eyes, right? <laughs> no, right? So let's continue. We have, you know, the shape. Asian monolith eyes, okay? Asian monolith eyes, the, you know, like this one. She has got upturned eyes, you know, like eyes, upturned eyes are like this one, okay? Es tipo de ojos, okay? Like this one. Now, curled eyes, you see? Downturned eyes, round eyes, okay? Almond eyes, like Angelina Jolie, okay? Narrow eyes, deep eyes, okay? Frontending eyes, okay? Different kinds of eyes. Do not worry, guys. I'm going to send you this PowerPoint presentation. Le voy a enviar esta <laughs> diapositiva para que ustedes puedan tenerla, okay? Now, guys, we have this one, the hair. We have, you know, black, dark brown, light brown, blonde, gray. We have straight, wavy, curly, okay? Bold, speaky, fringe, okay? Short, medium length, long, okay? Okay, now skin complexion, right? 
diferentes, ok. Ayer estamos diciendo las skins, right? So, pale, this is a kind of skin, right? Pallid, right? Fair, olive, ok. Tainted, ok. Light brown, este es como bronceado, ok, guys? Tainted, light brown, and dark, right? Now, other features, guys. Otras cosas de la apariencia, right? Freckles. So, these are freckles, guys, ok? Freckles, this one, ok? Mustache, ok? Bear. Wrinkles. Wrinkles are this one, right? These things here. Dimples. Dimples are these things right here on the cheeks, you see? Dimples. Now, guys, here, well, here we have, you know, like more examples. Now, guys, what is the order of the adjectives? This is very important when we are describing something, right? So this is the order that we have. First, the adjective must to be opinion. For example, beautiful, handsome, right? Then size, large, age, young, old, shape, round, color, brown, origin, British. Okay, this one, origin, you know, guys, it's like the nationality, right? So for example, Salvadorian, Canadian, American, right? And material, wool, materials, you know, con material, right? And now let's see, guys. Here we have this part that we were discussing. Para la altura, chicos, la edad y el cuerpo, vamos a usar el verbo to be, okay? Para la cara, los ojos, el pelo, eh, la piel, vamos a utilizar have got, has got, o simplemente solo have or has, right? So, for example, guys, what does your father look like? Okay, verbo to be. He's short, okay? Porque es la altura, right? Hey. He has got brown hair and dark skin. Okay, él tiene el pelo eh, café con la piel negra, right? What does your mother look like? She's tall, she's beautiful, right? Like this. And, well, we have this, right? Different kind of adjective. This is for personality, right, guys? Attentive, calm, cheeky, intelligent, faithful, pessimist, friendly, nervous, honest, hardworking, happy, good temper, okay? And like this one. So now, guys, our time is here. So, chicos, vamos a ver este ejemplo primero. So, it says, Appearance and personality. I am beautiful and young. I am short and slim. I have shorter length, straight blonde hair and brown eyes. I am quiet and sad. I am wearing a red top, okay, and red skier. I am Britney Spears, okay? So, chicos, ¿qué vamos a hacer ahorita? Well, Now, guys, on your computer or in your notebook or in wherever that you can type, donde sea que ustedes puedan escribir, guys, vamos a hacer algo similar, ¿ok? Vamos a describirnos a nosotros mismos utilizando adjetivos, ¿ok? Like this one. Vamos a decir, for example, I am, y dicen su nombre, right? For example, in my case, I am Eliezer. I am medium height. My hair, um, I, ha I have, ¿ok? I have got dark hair or dark short hair i have got a uh, dark eyes um white skin okay i am happy i am quiet i am wearing a jacket okay like this one okay chicos lo vamos a hacer en un not en su notebook guys lo vamos a escribir en su cuaderno si no tiene cuaderno eh, lo pueden hacer en un documento Word o en un notepad, en donde sea. Pero lo que necesito, chicos, es que lo hagamos y le tomen una foto a lo que escriban, ¿ok? Una foto de eso y lo envíen al grupo de WhatsApp, ¿ok? Describiéndose ustedes. Mínimo, chicos, quiero ver, one, two, three, four, five, six, al menos seis párrafos, ¿ok? Pueden ir así, como, como este ejemplo, pueden hacer igual que este ejemplo, pero no se lo vayan a escribir dos o tres cosas, ¿ok? Quiero que escriban todo lo que se pueden de los adjetivos, ¿ok? Describan su edad, 
describan qué tan altos son, cómo es su pelo, sus ojos, su piel, ¿ok? Y luego al final pueden poner un adjetivo que ustedes ya puedan, ya se conozcan, ¿ok? Por ejemplo, happy, ¿ok? Honest, ¿ok? Nervous, like this. So let's start doing that, ¿ok, guys? Empecemos haciendo eso ya, chicos. And now that we have time, let's see. Ok, so... Vamos a describirnos, ¿ok, chicos? Pueden hacerlo en cualquier lugar donde puedan escribir, ¿ok? So let's start, ¿ok? And if you have any question, let me know, ¿ok? Tenemos hasta las, let's see, 43, digamos, hasta las 43 para terminar. O 45, sí, tenemos tiempo. Son las 40. Son 5 minutos, chicos, para que lo hagamos, ¿ok? Así que hurry up. And if you have any question, let me know, ¿ok? Si tienen alguna pregunta, déjenmela saber, ¿ok? Eh, chicos, les voy a estar enviando, déjenme ver, la diapositiva, ok, que vimos, let's see. Let's see. Ok, se lo voy a estar mandando al grupo de WhatsApp, chicos, el link para que tengan la diapositiva, ok. Eh, si no la pueden abrir, um, igual pueden solo descargarla, right? O pueden abrirla en un modo incógnito, si su navegador no se la deja abrir, right? Let's see. Okay. Ahí está la diapositiva, chicos, pueden ver, ¿no? Ahí así pueden repasar y tomar sus apuntes, right? Si no les abre... Eh, y no las deja descargar, pueden abrir una ventana en incógnito si están en su computadora, ¿vale? una ventana en incógnito o en su teléfono y ponen el link y se los va a agarrar, ¿ok? So, come on guys, let's finish the exercise and let's see, ¿ok? Let's see how good we are in that part, let's see. You can type it anywhere, right, guys? Pueden escribirlo donde ustedes quieran. Puede ser un documento Word, en blog de notas, e incluso en el teléfono, en cualquier parte del teléfono, solo toman un screenshot, right? O en su cuaderno, si tienen, que es más fácil. En cualquier lugar que puedan escribir, right? Solo quiero que utilicemos las reglas que ya vimos, right, guys? Y los ver, bueno, los adjetivos que ya conocemos, ¿ok? Okay, perfect. So I have here Eduardo. Okay. Okay, very nice. Perfect, Eduardo. Very nice. Okay, so Eduardo finished. So come on, guys. Let's wait for the rest.
Okay, guys, come on. <clears throat> Pueden utilizar todos los verbos, guys, que I'm, well, sorry, los adjetivos que hemos visto, right? Any adjective that you want to use said, we have it here, right? También tienen la diapositiva ahora, chicos. Pueden también ver todos estos adjetivos, right? So you can get in common, right? Now, guys, let's see, 45. Okay, so don't worry, guys. You can continue doing it. Ustedes pueden continuarlo, continuar haciéndolo, okay? Eh, y recordemos que tenemos que entregarlo antes que se acabe la clase, okay? So, guys, now let me show you something extra for you, okay? Déjenme compartirles algo extra that I have here for you. So, para que entendamos un poco mejor, right? So, guys, tenemos esto, okay? Tenemos estos adjetivos que son para personalidad, right? So, we have this one, kind woman and selfish man. For the ones that finish, para los que terminamos, chicos, ¿qué creen que es kind woman? What do you think? Yes? <coughs> Any idea? Una mujer uh, amable. Exactly. Una mujer amable o gentil. Perfect. And what is selfish? Eh, egoísta. Exactly. Egoísta. Very nice. We have friendly man or woman. What is friendly, guys? Amigable. Exactly. Amigable o amable. So, si friendly es amigable, ¿qué sería un friendly, guys? Unfriendly. Uh, Sería alguien que no es amigable, right? Alguien como apático, right? Alguien no amigable, right? It's the opposite side. Now let's see. We have honest man and he's he or she's a liar. What is liar, guys? Liar? Mentiroso. Mentiroso. Perfect. Now we have cheerful. You see, this is cheerful, right? Cheerful man or woman and serious. You see, cheerful, serious. We have responsible, okay, and irresponsible. We have hardworking and lazy. What is hardworking, guys? Do you know this adjective, hardworking? Trabajador. Exactly. Uh -huh. Hardworking is trabajador. And lazy. Aragon, right? Uh, we have faithful, unfaithful. Faithful is, what do you think is faithful, guys? Fiel. Fiel. Fiel, exactly. O alguien confiable, right? Unfaithful, someone that is not reliable, right? Now let's see. Okay, uh, estoy viendo ya, chicos, que uno de ustedes ya compartieron. Okay, perfect, very nice. So, guys, we are going, you know, to see some of them. You are going, you know, to tell me, okay? So, now, guys, let's see. Well, we have this one. Now, guys, describing, you know, people's appearance. So, like the previous one, right, guys? For age, look, opinion, handsome, good-looking, body type, complexion. You know this, right? Seeing this thing that we have seen so far, you know, Hair, you know, face, how to describe it, the, tip, the type of color. So how can, well, here are some examples, right? So guys, here we have, you know, the questions and answer for this one. So I want you to, you know, to take a look of this, right? So for general appearance, guys, se dan cuenta que para apariencia general hacemos esta misma pregunta, right? What does your sister, what does you... Uh, your brother, what do you, okay, or what does she look like, okay? Esta es la pregunta para preguntar cómo alguien es, right? Cómo se parece, o sea, su parecer, appearance. And we have, she's beautiful and young, she's tall and sexy, she has a white complexion, right? For age, we have how old, right? How old is she, him? For height, how tall, okay? How tall? And for complexion, What is hair complexion? What is your complexion, right? Hair, what is her hair? Eyes or nose and nose. What about her eyes and nose, okay? 
She has a small brown eyes and a big noise, right? Mouth and lips, guys, this is something new. What about her mouth and lips, okay? She has big mouth and thin lips. Mustache and bear. Does he has a mustache and a bear? Okay. So guys, let's see. Well, before to continue with that, guys, um, let me ask some of you about what you have typed, okay? Acerca de lo que han escrito, chicos. Eh, bueno, creo que la mayoría ya terminó de escribir su appearance, right? Cómo se describen a ustedes mismos, right? So, guys, let's see. Vamos a work in groups, right? Vamos a trabajar y vamos a compartir nuestra información, okay, chicos? So I'm going to open some breakout rooms y vamos a practicar, okay? Con su compañero que le toque, usted va a describir, right, guys? Va a describir lo que usted ha escrito, right? Lo que usted ha escrito se lo va a leer y a ver si sus compañeros entienden, right? So, now let's see. If you can accept the invitation, guys, so we can practice, okay? Please, guys, accept the invitation for the breakup rooms, right? Let's go practice and be ready, okay? <clears throat> okay very nice. Okay. Okay. Okay, welcome, welcome. 
Welcome, guys. Welcome back. So I hope you have practiced, guys, because right now, you know, we are going to discuss. Well, I'm going to ask some of you to describe your appearance. Okay. So let's see. Let's start with Salvador. Hello, Salvador. Hello. Hi, Salvador. Can you describe? Well, what do you look like? Tell me. What do you look like? I have oval face, brown eyes, and wavy hair. Wavy hair, okay. Very nice, Salvador. Thank you. Now let's see. Uh, Jenny, hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, Jenny. So can you, you know, tell me how do you look like? Hi, I I am I have medium brown hair. Okay. I'm wearing a white blouse. Okay. And I okay. have brown eyes. Perfect. Very nice. Thank you. Thank you, Jenny. Now let's see. Hello, Claudia. Hello. Hi, Claudia. Tell me, what do you look like? Um. I am a middle-aged woman. Okay. I am short. Okay. I have eyes, uh, brown eyes. Okay. My face is oval. Okay. I have shoulder curly. Okay, very nice. Thank you, Claudia. Nice. Now let's see. Hello, Roxana. Hello. How are you? Hi. I'm good. Thank you, Roxana. So tell me, uh, what do you look like, Roxana? Um, I am Roxana. I am middle age, and mm -hmm. I am medium height. Mm -hmm. I am brown light hair eyes. Eyes. My eyes, perdón. Mm -hmm. And um, my hair is a straight. Straight. And I am funny, and I am pretty. Okay, very nice. Thank you, Roxana. Perfect. Now let's see. Hello, Lorena. Hello, teacher. Hi, Lorena. Tell me, what do you look like? I am short and thin. Okay. I have long brown hair and brown eyes. I am happy and quiet. Quiet, okay. I have, mm -hmm. I have 40 years old. I am okay. wearing a red teacher and black shorts. I am Lorena. Okay, that's perfect. Thank you, Lorena. That was excellent. Thank you very much. Okay, now, guys, let's move on. I have here, you know, like previous clouds, you know, I have this one. So let's see. But in this case, it will be a specific. So let's see. We are going to imagine the age, right? You can tell me he looks young, old, medium, um, elder. So now let's see. Let me ask... Um, Hello, Erica. Hello. Hi, Erica. Tell me, let's talk about him, okay? Tom Cruise. So tell me, what do you think is the age and looks? Describe him, please. He is. He is mm -hmm. uh, uh, tall. He tall, mm -hmm. height. Mm -hmm. He is thin. Thin, okay. Body. Um, I'm ceramic. <laughs> no, okay. Well, in the age, we can say he is um, in his 40s or 50s. I don't know how old is he. Older. Like this. Now, let's see. Advance. Let's see. Um, let me ask Omar. Hello, Omar. Hello, teacher. Hi, Omar. Tell me something about Tom Cruise. I have here hair and color, face, eyes and nose, mouth, lips, or mustache and beard. Tell me. Well, I think I'll cancel it, but one. He is a uh green or blue uh, eyes he has green eyes okay 
He has, uh -huh. mm -hmm. and, and the hair he has. He has a, a short hair. 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 Okay. And what about she, the face? She has a arm face. Okay. What else? Does he have mustache? Yes or not? Not. No, right? He doesn't have mustache. He doesn't. Okay. Thank you, Mar. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Now, let's see. Well, we don't have time, right, guys? I can see the time is sober. But we have some of this one, right? So, guys, let's see. Well, guys, we have finished one of the exercises of the platform. So, there is no excuses, right, for you if you didn't understand. So, you can, you know, if you haven't done it, you can, you know, do it. So, guys, tomorrow, you know, we're going to see something, well, different. So, I hope that you have learned about adjectives because tomorrow we are going to have an, an activity, right? So, please be ready, okay? And, well, that was everything for tonight, guys. So, good night and see you tomorrow, okay? Take care, guys. Bye, guys. Bye, teacher. 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 Bye, teacher.